Welcome back. We're here with Tunji, who is a toothpick artist. Tunji, welcome, welcome to, to the, the show. show. So, Thanks toothpick, so you know, toothpick artist, when I first heard that, I was like, uh, what? I, the funny thing is, I actually thought of like stick men, you know, circle and then just like hanging. But you need to explain this because this is absolutely incredible. Yeah. So, tell us how this all started for you. Oh, well, let me say this. Um, toothpick artist is my own niche in the. I'm a broad artist, I do all forms of art. Okay. Toothpick art is just. Um, that's my like your own, own speciality. Own special, okay. This is the first I ever made. It's like seven years ago. Oh, wow. I like how you still have that. And it came to best like more like experimenting. Mm. Okay. Usually my person, I create, from anything, I create houses from okay. anything. Okay. So I was just boredom, I think. Mm. And I was just assembling all these sticks all together. Yeah. And I got this. But amazingly, people got, saw this and liked it. And yeah. Okay. Uh, is it okay, see? Yeah, this is the first ahead. piece ever. Okay. Wow. So people liked it. And so be careful. <laughs> <laughs> More like Special. It. Yeah. Mm -hmm. So people liked it, and I was like, really, I could do better stuff. This is, I mean, the detail is as I mean, well. This is the Taj Mahal. Yeah, this is Taj Mahal. It's just like it. Yeah. Now this dome too is too big. Wow. Okay, so how did you do? How did you do the dome? Okay, now the first thing is that understand the fact that it is not hollow. Okay. That's one. It's not hollow. All right. Okay. So it's now let me just explain you this. Mm -hmm. This piece of paper I have right here. Yeah. No matter how thin, no matter how thin this yeah. seems to be, mm -hmm. if I have hundred of this, I'm going to add thin certain height, yeah. right? Very so true. same way. This, that's just the concept behind this dome. Okay. Why did I lay toothpick all together, glue it, and you know mm -hmm. if you glue several layers of toothpick, like, let's assume I glue this, mm -hmm. I glue this to this. Then to okay. another, you know, to I'm going up. to have I'm going to have um, a like a sheet. Yeah. Mm -hmm. okay. that I cut that sheet into circles. Oh, I see. Okay, okay. Now, so from that, now there's a little bit of mathematics. I read mathematics in oh. this. Then Gosh. <laughs> <laughs> there's something we call um, variation. Mm. I got the constant with you know the circumference now yeah. with height. Okay. So there's it's particular radius of that or no, diameter okay. of that. So okay. with that, with the level, there's a particular one now. Every, the toothpick now, the, the um, height of the toothpick mm. here is 0 0.2 centimeters. Mm. Okay. So centimeters. So I keep, um, okay, don't let me boil you down. Well, no, 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 no. <laughs> and my thing is, I'm actually just shocked that it it's so meticulous and the fact that you had to use math to You to didn't just like this. glue things together. Because I think you're people, planning people might hear, okay, you're a toothpick artist and it's just sticking a bunch of stuff together. But, because I did wonder, I mean, at first of all, I didn't actually know that this was toothpick. So the fact that you actually have to use math is quite astounding. So it's just simple mathematics thing. Simple okay. mathematics. <laughs> yeah, simple. I don't know if mathematics math is simple. Mind. But okay, I need to find out, how long does this take to make? I made this in 17 days. 17 days, wow. okay. 17 days. Okay. And this... This is the White House. This is the White House. This is... Can I pick it up? Yeah, sure you can. All right. This is insane. This is amazing. This is really wow. beautiful. Wow. Look at the flag. I know, the flag. The flag too is so to speak. Wow. That's just my craft. The same concept of that. Yeah. Do you oh. use this a lot to Can shave and this? to create? Steps. Can you hear? The only nice. part that is not so to speak in the standing mm. structure mm. is this, which is pencil. Okay. okay. Hey, look, I mean, come on. Yeah. Okay. Now, I know this sounds ridiculous, but how many packets, packs of toothpicks do you yeah. 5,000 sticks of toothpicks. This is 5,000 5, sticks, sticks of toothpicks. 5, and it took me five months. Well, that is amazing. Not, it, this, this piece, I think what happened, what, mm -hmm. what made it take that more time was the fact of the, the finishing, you know. Mm. It has to just yes. look like it. So it's, it's not that really tedious in code, mm. but... Um, well, I get I train people, but they don't want to function toothpick. I they think it's just too tedious. Well, I mean, okay. So tell us about the training. If it's not toothpick, is it just art in general yes. that you train? I I train core members. That's um, the federal government. Okay, for NYSC. Mm -hmm. I, I train core members in art generally. Oh, so right. the toothpick thing is my own kind of class. Yeah, so when they see this, they're like, they want to learn, they want to learn, and I tell them you cannot. They were like, okay, try me. But the funny thing is that when you get to train, people, I said I've trained several people. None of them is practicing because it's actually tedious. I can be in my studio for 18 hours. But you have to have you, so you, you have must, a passion. You must have for a very it, yeah, so, yeah, a passion for it. And you must be an introvert as well. I feel like you yes, have to be yes, really yes. good at working alone. I have very, alone. very boring lifestyle. So <laughs> yeah, I don't know. I wouldn't say it's boring. <laughs> I mean, it's not boring. It's so do you do you doing. sell this art to anyone? Is there anyone that buys it? I mean, tell us about that. Other aspect of art. Yes, for mm. this, no, for now, because um, um Okay, it sales with that soon, you know, mm. but most often it is on request, you know, yeah. just okay. my exhibition pieces. Ah. Yes, so. so what other art do you actually do? I mean, we know you specialize in toothpick art, so tell us about your other art. 
I do paintings, mm. graffiti paintings, and then um, that spray painting. Oh, wow. I do um, woodwork, glasswork, yeah. whole, whole lot of you know. For me to mm. train, I have to be vast in knowledge mm. of art. So I do that. So lots, 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 lots of art. Pieces. And where do you showcase your stuff as well? Um, well, I have my art gallery. Oh, okay. And where, where is that? that? In Choir State. Oh. Yeah. So in Choir State, so okay. I'm um, trying to relocate and yeah. get a better So you're currently living in Choir State? No, 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 in Lagos. Okay, State. you live in Lagos, okay. but your gallery is in Choir State. Choir State, so. Oh, okay. This is impressive. You know, I mean, this is traveling. really impressive. Thanks so much. Very impressive. <laughs> but I'm a bit curious. So, like, in terms of, you said you don't sell them. So, you, are you just doing it for the passion? Um, well, uh... <laughs> not really, <laughs> 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 because I, I I want to pick out to be self-sufficient, like mm. raise enough fund for itself, like mm -hmm. to, okay. to continue job. So mm. the passion, yes, then money. It's another. Um, it should be. A, a, let me see. A backup. No, not a backup plan. It should be. It's kind of just like a if it happens, it happens, or a side no, thing. Not, not that. It's it should happen. That's okay. yeah. So I I'm looking forward to making more money with South Africa art, definitely. Okay. okay. So, but I think for now, other forms of arts that I do support this. Support your artistic so, But I um, you know, it's 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 going to be frustrating if all you do is just follow the passion and, and get so much time getting, and you know, yeah. getting, so you're not getting. I'm hoping this turns. would um, finance itself some of that. Yeah. Day. Well, I'm okay. hoping. I mean, anyone watching the show will call you. You know about this because it's absolutely amazing. But yeah. okay. Let, we have something over here. Are you going to show us? Yes, I just want to make um, a fast piece. This okay. is um, a rough sketch of what it's going to look more like this. Okay, the more you're doing that, the more complicated it's looking. So I'm really interested to see <laughs> how it's going to look once it's on there. This is just an abstract piece mm -hmm. of art. Don't mind how ugly looking it is for oh, now. I don't know if it's uh, Dude, you haven't seen me draw. Exactly. <laughs> when I draw, it's like stick person. <laughs> Looks like hangman. So this... Um, I'll try to make this. So, and then, oh, sorry. So this is going to, you're going to put that on here? Yes. All right. So let me just show that to the camera. And he's going to do toothpick art. And we're going to see this with toothpicks. All righty. So off you go. Let's we'll see step. how it's done. Um, since I have to add it, then um, the sticks together, okay. I do not need the sharp edges. So the first right. thing to do is to chop off the sharp edges. OK. And I use this to chop it off. It's amazing how fast I've learned to do this. People, you can try this. Just I should give it a try. Yes. Ooh, me and sharp objects. I'm oh, a bit nervous. Yeah. Okay, so I'm trying to chop off the edge, right? Yes. Oh, it's uh, hard. What? Come on, put your back into it. I think I kind of sort of did it. That yeah. was. But my edge is completely not straight. <laughs> now my points. I don't know how, but um, I kind of do it very fast. Yeah. And just on one cut. Oh, wow. So I chop off the sharp edges, then mm -hmm. I kind of measure so that it's, um, there's a uniform mm. layer for that. Then. Um, Okay, nice job, though. Yep, yeah, you, you, had did, to you, just, you just, <laughs> just <laughs> redid re my work. Like, nope, that's not going to work out. Then they still have a lot of these mm. chopped off. Um. So, so once you cut those edges off. Yep. So I glue them. I use the white glue, the top bond is the okay. um, wood, the glue for wood. So okay. I'm just trying to add uh, these sticks together, mm. this, then to the next. Then I try to form the object, the image I have down here mm. on the piece of clothes here. Okay. And this is okay. padded with um, it's hardboard. We okay. call it All hardboard. Right. So just trying to form that um, image. Yeah. And then the next one. Wow. So this is Gosh, like the starting process. Yeah, yes. this takes, uh, this must take a while, right? That's what I have. <laughs> okay, well, obviously, we don't have the time mm -hmm. to see you do the whole thing, but of course, you have the finished product. So, can we have a look? The finished product just look like this. Oh wow, wow. that's amazing! That's amazing. So hopefully the, the camera can pick just it up. Like it. Yeah, that's it just looks. That's yeah. amazing. It's so really and, beautiful. Gosh, wow, this is really really impressive, and I've never ever heard of anyone doing yeah. this. Yeah, I mean, what ever. you're doing is very innovative. Yes, definitely. You know, Thanks so much. and we wish you all the best, and you know, I hope 
the toothpick art takes off and we get to see this in different galleries across Nigeria. I hope to, man. <laughs> <laughs> Thanks so much. I appreciate this. But yeah. before we go, I have yep. a present for Mo. Oh, oh, my goodness. That is so <gasps> cool. That is so it's cool. It's M.A. I can see the you know, profile yeah. and the EL logo. That That's is fantastic. Really cool. Tunji, thank you so much. We will make sure that M.A. definitely we will. gets this. Probably never do that. Thank you. Thanks so much. Thanks. We will be right back after this. This blender must be really you see? powerful. You see, that's why I was like, I want because, to see. Uh, when when I, have to I get mix my smoothies in my basic blender, I always have like chunks yeah, and chunks, and I cut it too. Thinking of banking in Africa? Then think Zines, one of the biggest in Nigeria, with assets over $16 billion. Listed among the 20 most influential brands in the world and winner of Best Bank in Corporate Governance. The most customer-focused bank in Nigeria. A success built on three foundations dedicated to people, technology, service. Zenith Bank, in your best interest. Africa. 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 It's about, it's about to change. change. It's about to change. 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 Forever. 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 GE's vision for Africa has always been the provision of a high quality life that is affordable and easily accessible of growth, stability, and prosperity. Rapid industrialization and development of one of the wealthiest continents in the world. Of power, superior technology, healthcare, and transportation. GE is committed to an Africa that works better. GE, imagination at work. Miss all those previous sugar moments? Not to worry. I just want us to have 